Hey mates, welcome to Tech Solutions. Do you want to install Waydroid on your Fedora 35? With Waydroid you can run a full-fledged Android operating system seamlessly with hardware acceleration and near-native Android performance right on your Fedora 35. Isn't this great? Let's guide you all with the correct Waydroid installation on Fedora 35. Let's work. The Step 1. Make sure you have an updated Fedora 35 with you. You can make sure to run the update command either with DNF or yum. You must be seeing we are on the most recent and updated build of Fedora 35. The step 2 is to have a Waydroid supported Fedora kernel. It's quite a tough task to build your own kernel with required features like Ashmum and Binder. Xanmod kernel is the best alternative to have these features. To be able to install Xanmod we first need to enable the copper repository on our Fedora. You can do this as shown. Once enabled, you will need to install the Xanmod kernel with the shown command. It shouldn't take more. You might need to allow with a yes to continue installing Xanmod on your Fedora 35. It's done. Now a reboot is required to start Fedora 35 with Xanmod kernel. Let's reboot. Press E during boot to choose the Xanmod kernel. Choose it and hit enter to boot. Welcome back. You can verify the booted kernel with the shown command. Step 3 is to install Waydroid. For this you will need to enable another repository. You can add the shown Waydroid repository as shown. It's time to install Waydroid. Install it. This may take a while. It's done. Step 4 is to edit the Anbox configuration file. Use Nano or any other editor on your Fedora to edit the Anbox config file in the shown location. Edit it as shown. Once done save it and exit the editor. Step 5 is to initialize Waydroid. This can be executed as shown. This command will download the Android system and vendor image for Waydroid to work on Fedora. This may take a while to download. Please have patience during this. It's done. Reboot your Fedora. Once again press E to edit the grub bootloader. The first entry is Xanmod kernel. Add the shown parameter as shown. This will make sure to avoid a LKMD crash. Boot your Fedora with the made changes. Welcome back once again. You can check your Waydroid container or session status as shown. Let's start Waydroid container and the session. Start Waydroid container first and start the Waydroid session in the new tab as shown. Give it couple of seconds. Android with user is ready is confirmation that all done and is working without any errors. You must be seeing Android applications in your Fedora applications menu. The basic Android applications are installed successfully. Let's start the Waydroid interface. Hooray! It's a joy! 
Waydroid is working flawlessly and seamlessly with Android 10 on Fedora 35. You can start using it for playing Android games or installing Android applications on your Fedora 35. It's way better than Anbox. Start using it. Anything to ask? Comment it. Thanks for watching. Good day.